Um, Paolo is can well, can be aggressive, especially off stage. I think I think Paolo Tan is actually extremely good off stage because of her nair. Right. And it'll be interesting to see if he plays that. I think coming from as I was saying earlier, um, it'll be interesting to see again. Smash Four players aren't necessarily as aggressive off stage because the ledge trap game was so good in Smash Four. So people are sticking with that. They say, "Oh, I'm just going to cover. I'll let you recover." Because most recoveries are pretty safe. Um, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I, I guess he is playing. I thought it was a hand warmer, but yeah. Well, nope. Just decided to do some movement. So one of the things I see with that, it's like you gotta you gotta wonder is like, did somebody just work on that, or do they have other, other stuff to go with it? So I assume Space Marvel obviously will have something else, but yeah. Some people Maybe are just like catch people off guard and uh, get in on it or something. <laughs> I always look at that, the, the crazy tech stuff, like the quick attack cancels that like Pikachu has, or I think he still has it in this game if you like do it off the edge. But, yes, like, I believe. Some of these other characters, you can put so much time into this. It's like, I almost feel like it's like melee. It's like the 12-year-old the who learned how to like multi-shine. Yeah. It's like, it's just, <laughs> they can do that. It's like, all right, yeah, but what else you got? Right. <laughs> so, Space Mario, obviously I have full confidence that he will show us other stuff, but we'll see. This can be really interesting to get on Pichu because, uh, that is a small character for whatever reason. And it's fast, too. It's fast, small, like, combo game is insane. I think that's one of the things that gets kind of overlooked with Pichu is his hurt box. Is that, like, how do you, like, right now, right there, the back airs. He's trying to space these back airs, but he's so small, it can be very difficult. So we'll see here, especially in this case. Trying to approach with shield. Yeah, you gotta respect that option. If you're in the right range of that, explosive flame is, uh. Yeah, and you also have the two rough. ranges, right? So the, yeah. the short and the long one. So I think I think the move gets over. Oh, Pichu is light. Yep. Forgot about that part. Also extremely light. Um, but yeah, if, if you don't, you gotta know to respect it. I think uh, if you know it's coming, it's pretty easy. I mean, especially on in singles, doubles is another situation in my opinion. Because mm -hmm. it can be really hard to see it come across stage because all you see is a little flicker of light and then it comes out. Right. Let's grab here. Let's see what we see. Nice. Dude, getting stuck on a ledge sucks in this game. Yes, it's, it it's, does. It's hard. I mean, so it would be nice if they added shield dropping. Um, I, they're not going to, but because the problem is if you're shielding on on a ledge, you can't go anywhere. All you can oh, do. Oh, nice jump. confirm there. That was a great confirm. But yeah, if you get stuck on a ledge, especially uh, PS2, any of the like, I guess, well, you know, but while we still have it, right? And then Battlefield, any of these ones here where you're like just at about head height on that platform, it's pretty rough. Especially since sorties have been so popular, at least to start. We'll see if it continues. I love it. Uh, I like to uh, shock people under it. Yeah, I mean that's try the to thing. read where they uh, where they're going. Yeah, there he is, going for the edge cancel. Certainly feeling so there. Good read off of that. Her reaction really. <laughs> Take that. Nice, nice back use of the back throw. throw. Just try to get Peach so off stage. Should recover. Oh, good sides to go high. That's gonna be rough. Back throw's gonna be close. Uh, I, don't I will know. do it. I don't know about that D either. It's close. That might have been enough. <laughs> he's flexing over here. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's doing the movement. That was cool, though. Yeah. Oh, I'm just glad that she's uh, actually a good character now, you know. And <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's it's kind of almost like they watched when we were playing with customs, and they're like, that's pretty close to how we want her to play. Oh, so yeah. Let's, let's she just was tone awesome her, with customs. Yeah, so like, let's tone her down a little bit. But I think, I think one of the overlooked things is the fact that they moved her. She now has a side B that's pretty useful. Yes. I yeah, because they combined it, uh, the counter and right. the... Uh, so they kind of took away what was a somewhat useless move. I say right. somewhat because it did have some uses. Oh, that four tilt. Four tilt's so powerful. <laughs> that has no right to be as strong as it is. Right. I mean, this little little rat, this unevolved rat, just comes up, sticks his toe out, it's, and you It's die. a baby Pokemon of, of all things. Yeah, I mean, it's a little rodent. A little electric rodent. It hurts itself. <laughs> Does it, it hasn't but it, learned yet. But it tapped. <laughs> oh, oh, catches the landing with the up smash. Good job there. But yeah, why is that so? I'm not going to say it makes me angry because it doesn't. It's just a really strong move and you got to respect it. But yes. the fact that it also hits below the ledge, now you're starting to uh, <laughs> starting to grind some gears. But good job to Space Mario on game one. So it looks like they're going to go to Kalos right now? Yeah, this will be another stage I think is interesting if it stays around. Because it's... Yeah, I think it should. It's not... This is the one I think is borderline should stay. I, I think... We'll see with stage lists and how they sort of evolve. But I think I think right now our problem is that we have too many stages that provide too many of the same advantages. So it becomes sort of unimportant to ban. Like, it depends on obviously matchups occasionally. But like... 
Well, th this is basically kind of like an FD with an easier way to recover. Yeah. And that, that, is, that is good for some characters, right, Where that have trouble recovering, that they can use that option to try to recover on. Yeah, and that's okay. the one this good thing. Is that, is that it? No. Oh, tries to catch a line with a forward smash there. Nothing. Gonna get comboed. Good read. That's one thing I want to see more people do is, especially because people want to start to like, I don't know if panic air dodge is the right thing, but they think the only way to get out of it is to air dodge. You have time to get over there and react, whether mm -hmm. it be to hit him with an attack or grab and start a new combo. Especially yeah, some it's, of these it's really kind of like that, uh, um, it's not a 50-50, that's the word I'm thinking of from Smash 4. Um, well, it was like air dodge reads. Yeah, air dodge reads, thank you. basically what it is. It is your, well, it's more reaction. It's almost like an aerial tech chase. It's kind of the way I like to think about it. Do you see these options? Like, either they're going to try and air dodge out of a combo, attack out of a combo, or they're going to, well, I guess air dodge or directional air dodge, I guess the other option. Mm -hmm. Or jump. And so it's like, those are the options you got to try and cover. And I think, uh, we'll see. I, that's, those are pretty much your options if you're stuck in the air. Because the disadvantage state in this game got way harder. Yes. Oh, nice double parry there. Uh, I think you parried the first one. Oh, you did the first one? Yeah. I think that's one of those moves where I think if you get the first one, you, you auto get the rest. Uh -huh. So 142%, of that Pichu <laughs> is uh, not very healthy. Pretty yeah. much going to die to just about anything right now. Let's see what's the edge guard here. Is that it? Ooh, I think he was like, he was doing the same thing. He was going for the air dodge read. Yeah. Oh, nope. Fair. All right, so fair is the one thing that won't kill him. <laughs> Granted, it was cross stage, but yeah, this can be this. All right, so he gets the up, or up air. Good move. You can say that with pretty much all of, actually, all of Palutena's aerials. I think her worst one is her down smash, probably, and even our down air, and even that one's pretty good. Yeah, off stage you can use it for spiking and whatnot. Air dodge is away. See, I think there he probably could have challenged that with a back air. It wouldn't have been tackable this percent. But why do that when you have a forward tilt? <laughs> Little twinkle toe. <laughs> yeah, but even then, uh, at a uh, 64, almost 64 uh, percent, Pichu is not really that healthy. <laughs> no, yeah, I, he gets hit by something strong at the ledge or just off the ledge, he might die. Yeah. But um, <coughs> oh, they have the combo potential to get back into this definitely easily. Yeah, I think that's that's one of Pichu's uh, claim to fame right now. Is low percent combo game is great. And has has the moves to be able to kill. Mm -hmm. like, the biggest thing he's got to deal with Back is throw. light. Cause oh. nice match there. Uh, it was a good match. I think he should have just done it though. Right. Probably would have killed. Spacing with the back air. It would have been close. Oh. I might be, I might be overestimating how light Pichu is. Ooh. It's punished there for trying to go for the slick tech. I think that's just a mistake. I don't think he's meaning to do those side bees, but it doesn't hurt him this time. There that's, it is wow. again. Strong move, man. I'm telling you. That's all you, all you got to do. Yep. Just catch these toes. <laughs> Gets forward still. Middle stage, so nothing going. Misses the edge cancel there. He's probably trying to go for something sick. Maybe like a down, down here or something. Okay. <laughs> Jab. So I got to find out, since I saw enough of it at Let's Make Moves, that the correct option to get away from people that are just holding jab is to roll, but I'm not sure the timing on it. Because if you roll at a certain point, then you still get hit. <laughs> right. Later. Oh. <laughs> we'll be seeing you. Shout out to Haz. <laughs> Shout out to Haz. Oh. Trying to go for the down air. Yeah, one of these things is there's some pretty tight windows on some of the combos, I think, for Pichu. Right. It can be pretty tough. But, I mean, he has some good ones. The one that's the... The one I love the best... Uh, down tilt down here on the ledge. This is just silly good. Mm. Is that going to be it? Oh, I can't follow uh, up. That, oh! That is, though. Catches them <laughs> afterward. <laughs> Lance. <laughs> they probably couldn't hear that. I hope so. Press, so. One, press one if you heard the Lance pop off for yep. Space Mario. <laughs> probably 